What a fascinating discovery. The Chinese rover Zerong has found new clues suggesting the existence of an ancient ocean on Mars. Among the evidence are pitted cones, polygonal grooves, and flow trails, which could indicate the presence of water in the past. Pitted cones. These crater-like geological formations may have been formed by the activity of mud volcanoes, where groundwater mixes with sediment and gases, creating a mixture that is expelled to the surface. On Mars, the presence of these cones suggests that there was water or ice in the region at one time. Polygonal grooves. These formations on the Martian surface may be the result of water freezing and thawing processes, suggesting the presence of liquid water at one time. Flow trails. Flow patterns on the surface of Mars may indicate the action of water currents, similar to rivers and streams on Earth. Sedimentary deposits. The presence of layers of sediment that would have been deposited in an aquatic environment is another strong clue. These deposits can form at the bottom of oceans, lakes, or rivers. Hydrated minerals. The detection of minerals that form in the presence of water, such as sulfates and carbonates, also supports the theory that there was liquid water on Mars. Radar analysis. Radar data can reveal underground structures that suggest the presence of ancient bodies of water, such as aquifers or underground lakes. Although these findings are not definitive, and some scientists are skeptical due to erosion and other factors that could have altered the evidence over time, the study suggests that this ocean could have formed about 3.7 billion years ago and disappeared about 3.4 billion years ago. For more solid confirmation, Martian rock samples would need to be brought back to Earth for detailed analysis. These clues, combined with the findings from the Zerong rover, reinforce the hypothesis that Mars may have had an ocean in its past. However, further studies and possibly returning samples to Earth will be needed to definitively confirm these theories.